YouTube, Johnny Kluznikov here. Uh, today's video is inspired or expired. What kind of life are you living? Um, this video comes as a result of a conversation with a student and we're talking about what's the point of life. Uh, basically what he said to me was, hey, you know, I live a spiritual life but I'm not really happy with the habits of the people I hang with. They like to drink, they like to smoke weed. I know it's not really the best thing for me, but I don't want to miss out on any fun. So my question to him was, what is fun? You know, what is your life all about? Is it just hanging around and doing what the people around you do, whether it's good or it's bad? Or is it for something else? Uh, what type of life are you living? Is your life inspired or are you expired? And I asked him that question and dude looked at me really funny. So what are you, what are you talking about? So we're talking about what's the point of life? What is it? Is it just to eat, drink, and be merry for tomorrow we're gonna die or is it to do something else? So there is, uh, I love word studies and I'm gonna give uh, a couple word studies in this video. The first word is inspired. If you take the word inspired, it's two parts. You have in spirit. Inspired means you have a spirit in you. Um, in the Bible, the book of Genesis, when man was originally created, um, first man's body was formed from the dust of the earth and then so God breathed into him life. And that's where the word inspired comes from, where he's filled in with his spirit, he's given new life, the breath of life. If you see somebody who is passionate about something, that they're really excited about what they're doing, you're gonna see a glint in their eye, a, a, a spark in their eye. That, that means they're inspired, they're enthusiastic. Um, they're, I, here's the second word for the word study. Enthusiastic. In, E-N means in. Theo means God, like theology. Theastic is what you're filled with. Your enthusiastic basically means infected by God, uh, by God's spirit, by his power for what you're doing. You're doing God's work. You're inspired. Enthusiastic. They basically mean the same thing. Are you inspired or are you expired? What's the opposite of inspired? Opposite of inspired is expired. When you, what happens when somebody dies? They, they, they breathe out their last breath and they're just gone. Um, I saw the guy who adopted me, Edward, I saw him commit suicide. I was there when he, he expired. He breathed his last, uh, his last breath. But he died a long time before then. He was a severe alcoholic and he died, uh, committed suicide by the bottle. Um, he was so bad when he was in a hospital room from one of his escapades, he was in the emergency department. Um, they did a heart scan on him and 85% of his heart was gone. He was only living on 15% of his heart. He died a lot sooner a long time before his physical body died. If you look deeply into the eyes of any alcoholic, any drug addict, anybody with an addiction that's killed their passion for life, that's preventing them from doing what they're meant to do, everybody's got gifts and talents from God. I don't care who you are. Everybody's made different by God. There's no two people exactly alike. We all have something different we need to do. We need to tap into what that is. Use our gifts and talents. You know, if you're wondering, what does God make? Uh, why did God make me? Why was I created? Well, it's to use the gifts and talents He gave you. To use your strengths. God would never ask you to do something you're weak at for the rest of your life. Um, so, are you inspired? Or are you expired? What kind of life are you living? Are you doing what you're meant to do, or are you? Dead, smoking weed and getting drunk and just wasting your time. You have one um, precious gift that nobody can ever give back from you, which is time. What are you doing? Are you living an inspired life, trying to help others, trying to use your gifts and talents, or are you just selfishly wasting on yourself through addictions, through no matter whether it's alcohols, you know, cigarettes, 
drugs, it doesn't matter. If you live a life that's controlled by something else, you're expired. You've died a long time ago. My goal in this video is to try to get you to understand, to, to live an inspired life and not be expired. Peace.